still. Turn subtitles on. Oh, jeez. <laughs> it's not letting me look. Oh, there. It's turn two. <laughs> So, yeah, first time I've streamed, some, streamed something that isn't Overwatch in a while. Um, I downloaded this the day it came out, but haven't gotten around to playing it, because I knew it was something that my wife Laura would want to watch as I play it, and I knew it was something I wanted to stream, so I had to make sure I had everything set up for both of those. Oh, okay. So it's a Resident Evil title, as you saw, but it definitely feels not like any Resident Evil I've ever played before. I shall dash them against the stones. Can I take that? Nope, i just leave it there. Oh, that's kind of cool. Yep, missing a fuse. I've avoided all spoilers for this. Granted, it's only been out for like two weeks now, I think. Oh. No, I don't think it's been out much longer than two weeks, hon. I'm gonna look. <laughs> I feel like it was longer ago than that. But anyway, um, avoided all spoilers. All I heard was that it's heavily PT inspired and uh, not much like whoa that's you know little little dolls like that creep me out like when they're just like I don't even know how to describe them when they don't have facial features or anything when they're just like sticks just wrapped together ugh I don't like it like Blair Witch Project? Yeah, like the Blair Witch Project. What's this called? This is called Resident... The game is Resident Evil 7 Biohazard. The teaser is called Beginning Hour. Oh, nice. Oh, it's a dummy finger. Okay. I thought it was an actual finger there for a minute. I didn't... I missed the word dummy on the beginning of that keyword. I'm kind of excited. Well, yeah. Um, anyway, what was I talking about? I already forgot. Oh. Before the dolls. No, we'll come back to that door. Um, oh yeah, avoided, I've avoided all spoilers for this, so completely blind. Haven't seen anything on it yet. Wow. Super dark. Let's just have random pictures of tree lines. I don't get that kind of stuff. Although it's very reminiscent of like old farmhouse, you know, built in like 1913 or whatever. And that's where you are. It seems like it. Ooh. Everything's obviously very dated. Ooh, what's that? Can I crouch? Is there a crouch? Oh, there's an inventory. It's an inventory. There's Crouch. Ooh. <laughs> My wife's over here just whispering commentary. <laughs> oh, <laughs> that scared me for a moment. My own hand slapping up against the freezer. Resident Evil 7 freezer slapping. <laughs> I 
definitely going again PT ish with the whole except for PT had a sink fetus yeah oh. PT it was too good for this world deserve it there is a doorway over here I thought so I do actually have the comments viewable this time. Normally I stream full screen without without being able to view comments, but I figured that you all would be screaming at me at some point or another to check something I missed or oh, that's inspiring or something like that. And I figured I'd see how it goes for once. But normally the few people that watch my streams are fairly quiet. So we have two doors. We got this one and we got that other one that was by the stairs. Oh, we also... We also have the stairs. Um, we'll go back and check the first door. Wait a minute. Oh, keyhole. Okay. I was wondering if it was something that I could mash X and, like, force it open. Escape the house is our objective. I, you know, realistically, I could get out there. But whatever. Yeah, we're going to avoid that for now. <laughs> Just makes me think of signs and the deleted scenes in that movie. Which I actually enjoyed that movie. I know a lot of people didn't. Okay, this door is locked. So I'm glad I came all the way back to it. But now we know. And was there anything in here other than creepy dolls hanging from the ceiling? No, there's not. Doing a really good job of building tension so far. Just put our son down to sleep. He finally fell asleep in my arms. Um, so, uh... <laughs> we got our baby monitor on, so that might scare me. <laughs> depending on the noise he makes. Um, but if I have to pause for a minute or two, I apologize in advance. Such is the life. Oh, oh, it's like half a cow. Bolt cutters. Oh, Jesus. Uh, the cow? I don't know. I didn't see it before it fell. So it fell from somewhere. Maybe, oh, I bet it was like, I bet I had the, the bolt cutters were stuck. No. I don't know. You can now go open that cabinet. Yeah, you're right. The chained. Can I close the door behind me? Nope. We're just going to leave the slaughtered cows. Well, it's not like it's not like I can uh, do anything in that room anyway. Bolt cutters. Snap. Videotape. Derelict house footage. That reminds me of Zoolander. What does? Oh, we didn't look in here. What are we eating? <laughs> no. Bugs, dude. A lot of mosquitoes out today. Uh, I drove home with the windows open and uh, stopped at a stoplight. And I, I think it was a mosquito, but I could feel a bug like hit the back of my neck and I did that what he just did where I slapped my the back of my neck like four or five times all the TV's going now yeah well the noise was louder so what is this oh the dummy finger that's right oh VHS Derelict House, June 1st. Haunted House Rehearsal. Clancy! Boo! Where did you find this guy? Give me a break, Pete. Hey, I only work with professionals. Oh, that's cool. I can control Speaking it in which, the... 
Make sure the sound is right this time. I don't want a repeat of Amarillo. That was two fucking years ago. I don't do ADR. This new guy? I'm not feeling it. Hey. Again? Just don't be surprised if we have to make a change. I'm right here, guys. New plan. We do a walkthrough of the inside first. Then we shoot the intro. Just like we always do. Just try to say the show's name this time, okay? Mm. No problem. Tonight on Sewer Gators, another worthless fucking shit -hole. Happy? Ecstatic. This actually... Other than the fact that it's on VHS reminds me of a... A book idea that I had a little while ago that I might develop. Are we rolling? All right, let's go. <clears throat> so this was the guy we saw in the intro, Get right? The this guy right here, handcuffed with the with the it's machete. Locked. Maybe. It looks like him. I mean, he has a suit on. After you. And short cut dark hair. Yeah, so it's hard to see his face now, obviously, because I'm behind him. Do you ever prep? What's the prep? Shitty house, spooky sounds. Ooh, is it haunted? Fuck me. I was an anchor, you know? Weekend sub, Pete. Not anchor. What's that? <clears throat> Nothing. Is the f is the focus getting weird because I'm this looking story, at Andre. Abandoned him? farmhouse, missing family. I'm trying to figure out if it's emulating the usual the actual autofocus of like a camcorder. How long did you say this place has been or if it's doing it for Three spookiness. <laughs> Probably listening to these guys. Clancy, get a shot of this. Clancy, I'm sorry. So, uh, Hillbilly yeah. Joe and his family go missing. Not Hillbillies, the Bakers. Jack and Marguerite Baker. Uh -huh. And they were quiet. And back. it puts the lid back, of course. A lot of bad rumors about their son, Lucas. Bad seat, apparently. Ah, shit! I knew I should've worn my good shoes. Oh, shit. Glad I had my shots. Although... This would make a great backdrop. Andre, what do you think? Andre? Andre! Andre! Clancy, you see where Andre went? Clancy! Stop it. <laughs> where is he? Unfucking believable This is the last time I work with that guy. I mean, producers, they come and go, but a, a good cameraman like you, Clancy? <laughs> you stick with me. I should have bolted up the stairs. See what would have happened. <laughs> fuck that, fuck that. What the fuck was that? Did you hear that? Can I open the door? Nope, I'm just the cameraman. Oh, <laughs> his shadow <laughs> scared me. Andre! <laughs> Is he? Oh, I thought that. I thought it was cracked open. I've already determined I can't open doors in cameraman mode. Andre, where are you, man? My flashlight is like the worst flashlight in the history of flashlights. Like seriously, like look at that. What the hell? It's a. You gotta be fucking kidding me. I would open up a crawl space. Oh. Alright, new deal. We, we find Andre and we go. I mean, fuck this show. Cause yeah, he'd be in there. <laughs> well, we heard the... We heard something move. I think it was that chain. So... Oh, it's the entrance. Okay. I thought it was like a total crawl space. Ugh. Creepy. First, oh, get a nice hero shot of me coming down the ladder. So, that's... uh, you first. Someone tells me that's not gonna happen. I can't remember that guy's name. Oh, this is a longer ladder than I thought. See? What is it? Oh, it's wet. And gross. Everything's wet. Resident Evil 7, everything's wet. 
Are you coming down? Do I have to move further away? Oh, Jesus. Speaking of Blair Witch... Mm. Andre? Yeah, that's the one image I've seen of this game. Oh, and I can't turn the camera. So, the main character, this guy that I'm playing right now, must not be Clancy. Or no. Is he? I'm. A, it's unclear. I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. It's a nice little, nice little reference to one of our favorite YouTube channels. Can I play the piano? Oh, I can. Oh! Creepy. Clichéd, but creepy. Oh, I wonder if I can use the... What? Examine, discard, use. Nope, can't shove the dummy finger in there. what the dummy finger is made out of. This is locked still, right? Yep. It's locked still. I try. So I guess we're going upstairs. Or no, shoot, no, I'm sorry. Should we check the crawl space? And go down and see if Andre is still down there? And then I guess we'll get our answer to see if I am Clancy or not. If I am Spartacus. Oh, it doesn't even open all the way. There we go. That's not what it's not what it looks like. Yeah, it is. Oh! There's no ladder. Should I drop down? See if it'll let me? No, I won't. I just got the back door key, though. So that must be the door that... Uh, I don't know. The one that's locked, like, just out the corner here? Out the corner. Around the corner? Oh, what? Talk to me, what? Just the... the... Oh, okay. I th thought you saw something that I didn't. I wouldn't be so calm. <laughs> Use. Cannot be used. What? Just ignoring the stairs mm -hmm. for now. Just gonna pretend they're not there. Whoa! This must be back door. The back door. Anything different in here? Teddy bear's gone. Or whatever it was. The toy. <laughs> Welcome to the family, son. Whoa! Oh my gosh, scared me. <laughs> Still. And back to here. Yeah, that is Andre. They're not Andre. We gotta get the hell out of here. <laughs> yeah. Pete. Come on. Yeah. Ooh. <laughs> hmm. Did I fail? Or is it are we gonna keep going? Family is expecting you early 2017. Open the door to Resident Evil Ambassador program. File. RE7. Is that it? Press any button. Oh my gosh, what if it is just like PT where it just repeats itself and like there's slight differences each time? That was a lot shorter than I expected, so we'll do this one... Maybe two more times. I read something about 
17 minutes. Yeah, and that, that we're at 20 minutes right now, so that would be about right. Like I said, we'll do it one, maybe two more times to see if anything changes. Don't have a videotape. So can I go right to this now? Oh, well, let me use it. Oh, it's one of those games. Oh. When I say one of those games, watch my playthrough of Alien Isolation and I complain about... Oh, no, because we didn't get a fuse. So, yeah, it has to change each time. So this is trial number two. I guess we'll be exploring the upstairs this time, as much as I don't want to. And this door never opened. So, I'm going to keep going. And this room is still just creepy hanging doll room. No other point to it. At least none that I can tell. Nothing. Alright, sh uh, should I go upstairs first, hun, or should I... <laughs> There's something shiny up there that's reflecting light back. I was back doing and... that in the video uh, on the VCR. It's like a button. <laughs> of course, there's creepy armless mannequins. Stairs button. I'm not going to push it. Not yet. I'm going to explore around. Oh, never mind. Well, the upstairs is... Uh, there's nothing going on up here. Other than a mannequin party. Maybe it drops another set of... St oh, my God. Oh, they're all facing me now, and now there's a a fifth, a third, a fourth. How many? <laughs> Four. A fourth one that just appeared. What was that game where every time you turned around, the mannequin would come closer? Um, I don't know of one with a mannequin. Oh, wait, you didn't play it. It was one that we watched. I don't know of one with a mannequin, but I know of one. That's what it's supposed to do. You're supposed to hit the button, turn around, and see her, and freak out. Um, I don't know, it stared. Um, I don't know of any with mannequins, hun, but I do know of SCP Containment Breach, which, uh, that was the one where it, yeah. Oh, I hear movement now. And we got... Oh, that's right, the bolt cutters are for the... Yep, it falls from the ceiling. Check... Oh, check inventory. I was like, what? Check what? Oh, check my inventory. All right. That's nothing. I keep expecting the mannequin to just be standing there again. I keep expecting that guy to... See, I don't, because, like, we know where he comes from. Oh, I didn't pick up the dummy finger this time. I forget where the dummy finger was. It was up in the room you started out in. That was derelict. No. no, it was in the hallway. It was Or no, wasn't it out here? I don't know where it was. I actually don't remember. No, Is this it. the same? That's the same. So you're gonna get the, yep, same cockroach. Leave it open, because why not? Dummy finger? Nope. And that's locked with a small keyhole. So yeah, there's stuff that... So far, nothing's different. I just went a way I didn't go the first time. Nothing in the fridge. The fridge is just a basically a gross window. Just look in and be grossed out. There's nothing. Microwave? Nothing in there. That's right. Okay. Oh, faucet. That is a faucet. No, that's not a faucet. Is it? No. Hun, what is this? Yeah, it's, you're at the sink. What's that thing on top of it? That's where you put your soap. Oh, I've never seen that before. That's a little dish for your soap. How genius. Ingenious. Ungenious. Are you okay? Yeah, I'm just... You sound broken. <laughs> I'm relieving the tension for myself. 
Oh, here it is. Here's the dummy finger. Here's that stupid finger. Maybe that. God damn it! Fucking noises. Do I have to watch the videotape again? Maybe I can do things. <gasps> Maybe I can change what I do in the videotape. Like, dash up the stairs. In the videotape. Um. Videotape. Clancy! Clancy Javis? Javis? Yavi? Boom. Ah! How did you find this Can I go anywhere else break. outside? Hey, Can I just be like, I work with fuck it. Later. Which, no, I can't. Sure the sound is right this time? I don't want to repeat of Amarillo. That was oh. two fucking years ago. I don't do ADR. What a big shot. Doesn't do ADR. Again? Hey, guys, come here, let's take a load off. Oh, it actually swings, too. I expected it to just be a wall. We do a walk through the inside first, then we shoot the intro, just like we always do. Just Anything else on the porch the out here? Time, okay? No problem. Tonight on Sewer Gators, another worthless fucking shit. Can I pick up the cinder block? Nope. Oh, I gotta wait for them to kick it down, literally. Oh, there's my shadow. Now, if I had a, v a VHS tape like that, then my shadow should be holding this gigantic camcorder. But Let's instead, go. my arms are at my sides. So, already I'm calling bullshit. Get out of the way. Should we make it look dramatic? It's locked. Oh, that's different. After you. Honey, who kicked the door so, open last time? Why are we in hell this time? It was prepped? suit guy, wasn't it? What's the prep? Shitty house, spooky sounds. Ooh, is it haunted? Cause Andre kicked it this time. Fuck me. I was an anchor, you know. We can oh, see if you can find Not anchor. What's that? Nothing. Just follow Andre this time, you're saying? Yeah. Why not? What's the story, Andre? Abandoned farmhouse, missing family, foul play suspected. The usual. How long did you say this place has been abandoned? Three years. <coughs> Clancy, get a shot of this. Let's make a great cutaway. Yeah, this was where I so, uh, I started watching the other guy. Go Not hillbillies, the Bakers. Jack and Marguerite Baker. And they were quiet, not backward. A lot of this bad is news about their son Lucas. No, never mind. Bad seat, I was just talking over it last time. <laughs> ah, shit. I know I should have worn my good oh. shoes. Oh. I'm, I'm stuck. Sure yep. Oh, yep. Shit. I'm stuck. You I had my shot. Nope. Although, this make a great backdrop. Andre, what do you think? Why would you walk? Andre? In the other room by yourself. Andre! Andre! Clancy, you see where Andre went? There is very... Oh, I can open the fridge this time. Is everything going to look good? Oh, I like that. I like Where that a lot. Un -fucking believable. Every time he says it, I think he's going to say, on fucking Dre. I mean, producers, oh my god, go look at how dark it is up here. Like you, you stick with me. I can't stairs this time. <gasps> can't pick up headphones. What if I'm not down there when he... No, no, because I opened the door to the other room. Just thinking, what if I'm not down there when he pulls the secret passage lever? Will I not know where it is in the actual game? Or in the current timeline? Gosh, it's so dark. Shouldn't have turned the brightness all the way down. What's in here? Dummy finger? Nope. Those are books. Nothing opens here. Does this room Did you hear that? have anything? No. So we hear the sound of the secret passage go off. Andre! 
Oh no, he does open it. I thought I opened it. Where the fuck is he? <sighs> okay. Andre, where are you, man? Yeah, the fact that it that it started back up again and didn't kick me to like a menu or something tells me that what the hell things are going to change. Well, and obviously cuz I haven't found a fuse yet. You got Secret passage open. Me. All right, new deal. We, we find Andre and we go. I mean, fuck this show. Yes, I know how to crouch. The thing is, it's like now, I'm, did I miss stuff to pick up last time? Or is it literally just like PT where they just throw new stuff at you every one or two times? Yep, I'm going. What if the ladder gets longer every time? Oh, that'd be cool. See shit. What do you see? Nothing. What is it? Andre? <gasps> and this was where, yeah. And the mystery man comes up. Okay. Oh! I shall dash you against... Oh! Instead of them, it's you. As in me. That's kind of cool. And now they know it's not there anymore and said they slapped... So that's... Wait... Yeah, that wasn't there the f last time. That note wasn't sitting right there. Mm -mm. That box looks bright. I bet that's going to be something later. Looks like it's an interactable object that I just can't interact with yet. Back door key. Alright, should I try dropping down this hole? This time? Oh, it just straight up won't let me. Never mind. Oh, I thought maybe I could. All right, so I got the back door key. I shall dash you against the stones. Again, totally blind playthrough. This is my second attempt so far. And it just seems to loop around. None of these are openable, huh? Nope. We heard that last time, yeah. Doesn't make it any less tense, though. Dummy finger. I'm trying to think of what you'd use the dummy finger for. Can I... Is that mannequin still? Those three are there, but the one in front of the stairs is gone. How many are there? Three. Oh, three. Can I stairs? I can stairs. Can I... Would this do anything? Is that the dummy finger? It is. No, I can't push the button with the dummy finger. Now there were headphones here, now they're gone. And is that mannequin in front of the stairs again now? No, she's not. So we didn't get the mystery mannequin. Maybe now we will. Maybe now we will. Nope. All right, let's see if we can... No, it just goes up in the ceiling. There's got to be something... I guess there doesn't have to be. Especially if it's a repeatable trailer, or repeatable teaser that changes each time. Then there doesn't have to be anything. But still. Do you... Whoop! Do you... Can I bolt cutter you? No. Can I dummy finger you? Can I dummy finger the dummy? Oh! 
pushable. And apparently I can clip into them. <laughs> and it pushes super silent. Can I push it down the stairs? Yep. <laughs> yes, I can. <laughs> Where'd it go? Oh, <laughs> flopped around. Oh. Is that? No, it's just an outlet. It's nothing. At least it's nothing yet. Alright, well, I got one of them down the stairs for shits and giggles. What? I wish I knew what the stairs button was for. It's not responding. Now it says it's not responding. Is there, like, attic access or something? It's hard to tell. It's hard to see anything. Alright. <laughs> the number's been changing quite a bit, hon. Well, I'm trying to distract myself, okay? <laughs> Our highest was eight, and now we're down to five. Oh well, they come and go. I also think think that the number isn't like 100% accurate. I think it... Alright, I guess we're just gonna go out. Oh, mannequin. Spooky. I didn't realize that was a hat at first. I got a little freaked out. Nothing with those. Just pictures. And dead cows. Do do where is it? Back door key. Alright, here we go. Oh <laughs> Welcome to the family. No. <laughs> Same thing. I thought I actually got outside there for a moment. No. <sighs> see if this changes. We gotta get the hell out of here. <sighs> Nope. No difference yet. Alright, I'll run through one more time just because it's so quick. See if there's any anything different this time. For those of you watching, if you've played this before or you're familiar with it, I wouldn't mind a hint. Simply because I don't know. It's like, when PT did it, it was original and it was fresh and all that. But now it just feels like it's trying to be PT in the whole, we're going to repeat it and do the same thing over and over again. But maybe change stuff up. But at the same time, I also don't want to hint, because it's like, no. I can do this. I'm a big strong man. It's not as scary this time, I'll tell you that. You're a big strong man who don't need no woman. No, I do need a woman, I need you. <laughs> you don't need me. We can talk about it. I would like you. Oh, yeah. I do like you. <laughs> Sorry, we're getting our silly romantic stuff on stream. Speaking of which, we speaking of silly romantic stuff, we gotta play uh, Resident Evil Revelation. Oh, gosh. Yeah, we lost everybody. They're all like... <laughs> oh, <laughs> it's not responding. Mannequin? No. It's weird. Well, yeah, but last time it didn't come until you went around this corner. That's true. But no, we uh, we have to continue our playthrough of Resident Evil Revelation nice. 2. Oh, oh, not what I meant to do. I don't... Oh! 
I didn't try pushing her last time. They wouldn't implement this stuff unless it was meant to be used, right? That's what I can tell myself. Go down the stairs. Maybe that's what I have to do is I have to push her down the stairs. Oh. Go. <laughs> Not as elegant as I... There we go. <laughs> that looks silly. <laughs> Just sliding. Oh, she stay out of the way. Okay, that wasn't as uh, eventful. <laughs> it was actually awkward. <laughs> oh. Garbage bags of refuse. Of bodies. Bodies. Cook the bodies in the stove. Cook the <laughs> bodies in the stove. <laughs> oh, drowning pool. Back when I was a super hardcore eighth grader. Nothing. A small keyhole for a small key. I'm checking everything just in case something changes. So far, nothing has. Man, how funny would it be if I told all the same, like, little stories and stuff each time I did that? So I was driving home with the windows open and... You'd really lose everybody. <laughs> or I'd gain a bunch of people. That's one thing I learned about the internet is that just because you think something's stupid, there's usually a lot of people who like it. Look at cat videos, for instance. It's just a cat, people. Settle down. I don't know what I'm ranting about now. Ignore me. No, don't ignore me. Watch my stream. Oh, that's weird. I was like, why is it not letting me cut it? But that's because I have to actually hit X on the thing. Is there more in here that for me to pick up other than the tape? I don't think so. Wait, did that... No, that didn't change the title. It was still derelict house footage. And I don't see anything else. Okay. Oh, there is a, a run. Sick. Can I stairs now? It's not responding. This is the most frustrating... I think this is the most frustrating part of this house. Because... There's not even a prompt for me to mash and not get a response from. It's literally just a little alcove. Hey, the mannequin's gone. The guy came and grabbed it. Yeah. Let's try the door at the end of the hall again. Nothing. They really kick in that sound effect because they want you to know. Right. Seems like most of the exploring you have to do is in the flashback. In the tape? Yeah. Don't you think? I don't know. Oh, I thought you were. You have the... I thought you were like looking it up and reading it to me or something. Oh, I did read stuff, but I didn't oh. say anything to you. Oh, okay. oh, that's different. Boom. Oh, Jesus. Where did you find this guy? Give me a break, please. Hey. No, but the I opening was different. Which, it did the rainbow right standby thing. And then after that, it had, like, the tracking lines on it for a good three, three, four seconds. Okay, so explore more in the flashback. Yeah, that would make sense, because then, then you'd be setting stuff up. Yeah, for future Clancy. Just like we always do. Just try to say the show's name this time, okay? No problem. Tonight on Sewer Gator. Okay, there's nothing Another outside. Fucking shit. 
I'm gonna pay attention to this again and see uh. see who opens the door. See if that really did change or if it was just just my imagination last time. Just my imagination. Are we rolling? Right, yeah. Let's go. Get out of the way. It's locked. No, it didn't change. I was crazy. After you. So I don't think there were bugs here outside? last time. Yeah. Do you ever prep? Were there? What's the prep? So. Shitty remember house, some... spooky sounds. Ooh, is it haunted? You remember bugs last time? I do remember bugs. Okay. The only bug I remember is that cockroach. Fuck me. Again, call back anchor, to PT you know? with the cockroach so. right away at the beginning of that. Anchor. What's that? Nothing. I've watched PT like ten times. Well, at least the story, the playthroughs that farmhouse, missing of the people that I follow on YouTube. The usual. A couple different channels. How long did you say like this I said, that was, it was too good for this world. We didn't deserve it. Just sad. Clancy, get a shot of this. Let's make a great cutaway. Chop, chop, chop. So, uh, yeah. Hillbilly Joe and his family go missing. Not hillbillies, the bakers. Jack and Marguerite Baker. Check the quiet, soup again. A lot of bad yep. Rumors about their Still gross. Bakers. Bad seed, apparently. Ah, shit. I don't think I checked the drawers last last time I was in the flash black uh, flash black. I didn't check the fridge. Andre. 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 you see where Andre went? Yeah, he went. In down the hallway. All right, seriously. Unfucking believable. I still think he's gonna say I'm fucking Dre. <laughs> I mean, producers, they come and go, but a, a good cameraman like you, Clancy, you stick with me. Okay, check upstairs again. That's not a button I can use. And again, there are headphones here. Which there aren't normally, like in the actual, in the regular timeline, in the current timeline. In Clancy version 1, there's no headphones on that table. But I can't do anything with them. Oh! <gasps> Hun, the mannequins are gone. Wait, were they always gone in the flashback? I don't remember. No, I'm not really that scared right now because this is my third time going through it. Um, it repeats. Like, you play it once, and then once you're done, it starts over again. And, and things are supposed to be different each time, I think. Or you're supposed to be able to discover new stuff each time. What the fuck was that? Um, so Did this being that? my third time through it, I'm, I'm kind of... I'm, I've learned where all the regular stuff is, and I'm just trying to figure out what I missed. Andre? Where the fuck is he? Ugh. Okay. Andre, where are you, man? Mm -hmm. Of course, the thing about playing a game like this where it repeats like that is then, as I'm sure those of you who've watched me do more than one run-through, um, I start to question stuff like, ooh, this is new. Oh no, it's not. It's actually always like that. You, you know, that sort of thing. All right, secret passage open. All right, new deal. We, we find Andre and we go. I mean, fuck this Nothing. show. Nothing. But no, definitely when I started this stream, when I the first time that we went through this, I was much more jumpy. But this time. Just feels like rehashing old ground. Maybe I gotta look around more downstairs. That's not gonna happen. What did I miss? Okay, Andre's over there, and I know 
I know once I approach him, it's gonna trigger. What do you see? What is it? Can I go back up the ladder? I can. <gasps> I wonder if this will. Will he actually react to me coming back up, or will he just be standing there looking down the. Nope. He doesn't care. <laughs> That's creepy. That's... That's creepy in itself. <laughs> to me, it's just immersion breaking. It's just like, oh, they didn't expect me to come back up the ladder. Okay. I wonder if I can push. Oh, I wonder if I can push him down the hole. Like I can push the mannequin. Can I? I can't even get directly behind him. Never mind. Oh no, I didn't want to do that. He's careless. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> he is without a care. He is careless, if you will. Carefree, even. All right. See if anything changed while I'm supposed to be downstairs. Do do. Oh my God. This is a lot darker than uh, I remember it being. Oof. Oof. Dark. Such dark. But if my wife is correct in that most of the exploring needs to be during a flashback, then I'm glad I'm going back and... She's doing her thing where she looks up the game online and learns more about it as I'm blundering through smashing buttons and... Can trying to figure to. shit out. Um, have I haven't passed whatever I need to do, have I? As in, like, I can still do whatever I need to do, right? So from what I read, I mean, it was like one little thing that I read that I can remember. Okay. Can I go back outside? I mean, we broke open the door. Nope. It has been locked. Oh, that freaked me out for a minute. I thought there was suddenly something in my way. Nope, I just sidestepped. Surprise sidestep. <sighs> Darkness. Wasp? Or are you doing... Okay. I don't know. <laughs> I don't know, honey. I'm... I'm older than the internet. I don't know what it means. And I'm older than you. <laughs> <sighs> Those headphones annoy me. Because I know there's something there. Or rather, just because that's the one thing that I've noticed that's like blatantly different. Oh my god, it's so dark. Oh, wait. What are you... Oh. Nothing. Okay, let's look at the stairs button. Which... It... Nope. I feel like that cable... It's a bright white, so I feel like I should be doing something with that. Wait a minute, there were boxes here I could push. They're not here anymore. So is there something... No? <sighs> Texture popping. I feel like I feel like the dumbest person in the room. <laughs> I feel like I should be able to see Um You know, I I don't know, it seems more like a Texas Chainsaw Massacre sort of thing. Or like a, uh, uh, what was the Rob Zombie movie? 
There is his first one. House of a Thousand Corpses. What's that? I said, yeah, I would have said that. I would have guessed. Oh. Right. It seems, this seems more like one of those rather than traditional Resident Evil, which is weird. Because traditional Resident Evil, like they, or rather when they released this, when they talked about it at E3, they said they were excited to get back to Resident Evil's roots. And this is not what classic Resident Evil is like. Classic Resident Evil is very action movie. Yeah, no, I'm, I'm not going to. <laughs> There's no worry about that. Uh... Again, this is my third... Oh. Nope, that's nothing. That's nothing. Um, this is my third time through it, and I still haven't noticed what I'm supposed to be doing. Okay, hon. You're looking at the floor everywhere, too. I thought I was. Be more specific. Corners. Can you be more pacific? Well, you said you were going to give me a hint earlier. I'm I'm open oh, to hints now. You said in the kitchen. In the kitchen. I'm in the kitchen. I keep hearing sounds. Corner floors. Look at the corners. There's a basket. Maybe I should just crouch and... This is a corner. That's nothing. Ugh. That's a corner. And now I'm literally just tracing the floor. <laughs> Riveting gameplay tonight. I appreciate you guys sticking with me so far. We're really building the atmosphere. We're learning this house 100%. This is our house now. Oh my god, my hands scared me. It did it again. What did I say at the beginning of the playthrough? Resident Evil 7. Freezer slapping. <laughs> or whatever. Yeah, I don't know, hon. I didn't see anything on the floor in the kitchen. Unless it's around the table. This, this house reminds me of... Um, my... How are they related to me? Some, like my dad's aunt, my dad's uncle, they have an old, super old farmhouse that that he built himself, you know, way back when. Um, back down the stairs. Oh, well, yeah, I've... I guess I was checking to see if I missed anything before I activated this scare. Oh, thanks for the subscription. I was gonna, I was checking to see if I missed anything before I continued. Simply because, again, I've done this, this is my third time through. So, oh, not, not in here. Well, let's check the floor in here. This is my third time through, and my wife, whether or not it's reliable information, uh, said that anything, or most of the exploring has to be done during the, the flashback scene. So I was just... Dotting my I's and crossing my T's, so to speak. Alright, back down. I guess I'll go another another time through. Oh I gotta change position though, my legs are hurting from sitting how I was. Okay. Did what? What, hun? Did a jar fall out of the refrigerator and smash on this thing? I Oh, a jar in the refrigerator. Yeah, something fell out. I guess I didn't hear it smash. I didn't think it smashed. My character's wearing a blue shirt. And I just noticed that now. Is it denim on denim? Is it denim? <laughs> okay, Jeff Tate. Oh, there you, Jeff Tate. Denim on denim. Burrito expert. That's... That's, thing's falling out of the fridge is something. But it's mentioned in the... Yeah. <laughs> okay, let's go check the fridge. More specifically, the floor in front of the fridge. In the jar in the fridge? No. Oh. There's a thing you have to get in. 
Yeah, I just, that bit that we saw was all in the tape. So there's the jar that fell out of the fridge, but it didn't open, it didn't break. But there's a, okay, so now my wife is telling me that there's a lock pick in the flashback. So now I'm just going to advance. Wait, Wait what? Go, go back into the room and start. Okay. The room I start in, which is the tape room. Yeah. It said the tape, tape worm, so tape room. You can the secret. You can activate the secret door. Yeah. Right away. What? It didn't let me before. No. All right, we'll try it. Well, I gotta, I'll finish out this run and start a new one. Well, that's right, you're still doing the old Yeah, I'm finishing this one. Back door key, and it won't let me go down. Because there's no ladder. Okay, so now we're getting somewhere. Now my wife is divulging information. In case you can't hear, I'm not sure how strong this mic is. I'm going to try doing this thing again. Oh, yeah, there are three. Okay. Nothing. No headphones for whatever reason. What? No, I just... The lamp is in a different spot, though. I'm looking at my phone. I can't knock over these mannequins, but the one that shows up in front of the stairs I can knock over. So I'm going to see if I can get her to show up again. And then I'm going to try and, like, knock her down the stairs in one fell swoop. And that'll be, like, subtext for my character being the murderer. I don't know. It's not responding. Thanks, yeah. <laughs> I will. It's, it you know, it's obviously PT-inspired, as I talked about before. But it's different from PT in that it's a longer, like it's more of an endurance thing than PT was. PT was very much, oh god, I, I forgot about that. That's why the mannequin wasn't upstairs. Um, uh, PT is very, uh, like, you know, just repeat, 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 um, quick. Because it's just the one L-shaped hallway. But this is more of an endurance thing. It's more of a, like... <laughs> Testing your stamina. Ooh. <sighs> Back at it. Come on, Pete. Quit dragging. We gotta get the hell out of here. Hey honey, did you see if they're making a live action Pete's dragon? <laughs> Maybe I should be paying attention to the times on these tapes here. Because I've noticed they've been drastically different, but I haven't noticed if it's been different from one playthrough to the next. I just know it's different from, like, intro to outro to flashback and all that. Alright, doing it again. Resident Evil 7, beginning hour. We're now over an hour. Act 4. Act 4, yeah. This is the fourth one, yeah. Part 4. Chapter 3. Get out of the house. So what does that say? I, will, I shall dash them against the stones, and then later it'll say I shall dash you against stones. So you're saying I should be able to activate this immediately. Yeah. Nope. Yep. What? What? Did you see the clown? <gasps> oh, that's finicky as fuck. Okay. This is new tech, people. Fuse. I only have two things for you, and that was one of them. <laughs> well, this is just the the teaser, um, just the playable demo for the, for actual Resident Evil 7, um, and part of me thinks that 
when Resident Evil 7 comes out, it's not going to be first person like this. I think it's actually going to be third person. Okay, so here we go. Uncharted territory, folks. Exciting. All right, let's check that button. I bet that button will do something now. Let's check this. Maybe this is a fuse door. Nope. Are you guys different? Nope. I was thinking about the fridge there for a minute. Oh, the button's green now. Our fuse worked. Let's check around the corner first. Scope the entire area out. Should I check the whole downstairs before I hit the button? No, I think I should just hit the button. Let's do this. See ya. <laughs> well then, should I wait to hit the button in case you end up peeing your pants, hon? Mm, I think if I didn't pee my pants when I was pregnant, I'm okay now. Okay. Aha! Attic access. Ooh. Is that in the game? <laughs> I don't know. I feel like my dad. Is that on the TV? That's how my dad sounds, apparently. <laughs> <laughs> Is that noise on the television? I don't know what I'm doing. I know what I'm doing. I know. <laughs> this is my dad's Sean Connery. I'll open this door. Yes, I'm playing on the PlayStation 4. <laughs> this is how I relieve tension in a scary <laughs> video game. Oh, <laughs> uh, yeah, I'm playing on the PS4. Let's answer the call. I know who you are. Who are you? You will have to say goodbye eventually. But will you be ready? No, there's going to be someone behind me. Right. Say goodbye. That's sim... Oh, oh Jesus. Gosh. Fuck you! Welcome to the family, son. Oh, my God. Oh, you did okay. There. Oh, my gosh. So it's... Still. So that's reminiscent of yeah. PT with the ghost scare. Um, in that it can happen... We gotta get the hell out of here. ...more than just one place. And that phone call was reminiscent of PT and it reminded me of the radio in PT where yeah, he got me again. <laughs> You're right. I don't know if if it's triggerable, like if there's something specific that I do that causes him. Okay, now that time is the same as last time we saw it. I don't know if it's if it's something specific that I do or move or whatever that that uh, causes him to show up. But I, I didn't pick up the picture that was upstairs. Instead, I answered the phone right away. So this time I should pick up that picture. Maybe that'll have something. But we're going to do the same thing again. We're going to go for the fuse and go upstairs twice. And I'm pretty sure that hallway was a dead end on the other side of that door. Or not other side of the door, but... There is a goat. Well, yeah, I, I think. I don't. I think the ghost is what's killing Pete in the video. Green teethed, yeah. weirdo ghost. I don't know. I obviously don't know. Hmm. Well, that's interesting. You know. This is so weird that this has the Resident Evil title on it. Because this is so not Resident Evil. And I know I keep saying that. I know I keep kind of repeating myself and I apologize. But it just boggles my mind after we've had Resident Evil be very action movie zombie fun for however many years. And now suddenly it's 
at least this, at least this demo, is like creepy supernatural ghost story stuff. Let's, I'm going to double check to make sure I didn't miss something. No, um, yeah, PT was the playable teaser for Silent Hill 5 or Silent Hills. There's still some debate as to whether it was actually called Silent Hill 5 or Silent Hills because it's unclear if it's an S or a 5. Anyway, um, Silent Hill is my all-time favorite horror franchise uh, just simply because of one... I can't tell what that is. It's a helicopter. Oh, it's a helicopter. You're right. Are they watching us from that helicopter? Ooh, I like that. I like that a lot. No, take it. Oh, I can't take it. I like that a lot. So now, that guy just appeared, didn't he? Or did he, like, pull me around? He must have pulled me around. Nothing. And that mannequin is another non-interactable. Two shoes and a boot. It's the title of my next short story, Two Shoes and a Boot. I know who you are. Who, who are you? You have the power to choose. <gasps> but the outcome of that choice may not be what you expect. The power to choose. Mannequin's gone. No, it's not. <laughs> no, I'm just making shit up. No, um, Silent Hill 5 never got released. Uh, because it was... Kojima was supposed to be developing it alongside Guillermo del Toro for Konami. This was back when Kojima was with Konami. Hideo Kojima. But then they had a falling out. He left on bad terms... Konami retains the rights to Silent Hill, um, but I don't think they're ever going to do anything with it, personally. And if they do, it's probably going to be a... Welcome to the family. Oh. Okay. So the did phone... Just randomly get Jill? Yeah. I think he did. I, I don't know if it's a triggered event. Like, I don't... I'm just moving, you know what I mean? Like... So I think he is random. We gotta get the hell out of here. Which makes this incredibly frustrating, if he is random. Um, but, uh, so there's a lockpick somewhere in the flashback video, you're saying. Yes. Which I still have not found. Time's the same. The family is expecting you. Yeah, that's very Texas Chainsaw, Devil's Rejects. All right, I'm gonna try it again just because it's it's very compelling. I feel like I'm you know because I make that little bit of progress each time, or at least something different happens each time. That phone conversation was different this time this last time, so I wonder if it's... I wonder if that's just because I looked at the picture this time, whereas the last time I didn't. If that's the only reason. Which, if that's the case, I should do the rest of the downstairs stuff before I go upstairs this time. See if that makes any, any, any difference. Fuse. I got an energy drink. That was a bad joke. Fuse the energy drinks. <laughs> I appreciate the laugh, honey. Okay. Now we're getting somewhere. Anything different in here? Nope. It's still just the creepy hanging doll room. Let's pick up that dummy finger. 
see if that changes anything. Check inventory. Part of dummy's hand, made of celluloid. Use item. Okay, so that's like a quick equip or something like that. But I can't, at least yet, I haven't found an item that I can move. So. Okay, my dog moving on the couch behind me scared the shit out of me. That's not him. Okay. <laughs> um, so I mentioned that that my son is asleep. Uh, my three-month-old son. I well, my six-year-old daughter also came back from her biological father's today, and she's been awake. I don't know if she's been she's been listening for sure. I don't know if she's been watching, but <laughs> I heard her move behind me, and that freaked me out. Um, so my wife is taking care of her right now. Oof. Parenting and gaming. That's kind of how it goes. Um, yeah, I did find a key earlier. It is for the back door. Opening the back door always triggers Mr. Welcome to the Family. Um, at least it has every time so far. So because I know that that ends the current run, I've been waiting. I've been doing other stuff before trying the back door. So... So that's kind of what I'm doing. So I'm, I'm, yeah, uh, I'll, I'm going to wait till she gets back before I keep going. Um, but yeah, since the back door always triggers him, I'm just putting it off so that I can explore more of the house. Um, I know there's a lock pick that I haven't found uh, that I need to use. And that's probably going to be used on the stuck drawer in the kitchen. I'm going to try not opening the fridge here and instead opening it in the flashback of the tape first and seeing if that changes anything. Um, yeah, because then he would have to open it and then shut it. Rather than... No, not necessarily. Because there's different items in the fridge each time. Or went from the flashback to the current. Oh, it's, it's a puzzle, guys. It's a big mind puzzle. Um, so this would be a good time to talk about it. Uh, if you're liking this, if you're liking this stream, um, and if you like any of the other games that I've been playing on my channel, uh, primarily like Overwatch or Resident Evil, uh, those sort of things, um, I am a part of uh, an organization, a nonprofit organization called Extra Life. It's all about playing games to raise money for children's hospitals. Uh, I would encourage you to go to extra-life.org um, and donate. Uh, and if you want to, you can go to my Extra Life donation and help raise money for for my specific foundation or my specific children's hospital that I have picked out uh, you can find that by going to nicholascorey.com and I have all the the uh, extra life fundraiser stuff on there but as part of that extra life fundraiser I'll be doing a 24 hour gaming marathon on November 5th playing games for 24 hours and I'll be streaming as much of it as I can uh, some of it will be tabletop games some will be video games um, obviously the video games anything I play on the PS4 will be streamed. Um, so look forward to that. Donate anything you can. 100% uh, of all money raised goes directly to the uh, the 
children's hospital that either I selected or you select. So, so every dollar you donate is uh, going to kids who need it. So extra-life.org or nicholascorey.com and then just visit the the Extra Life fundraiser page. Is everything okay, hon? Yeah, I think she had a bad dream. Mm -hmm. oh. But she didn't know what it was about. Well, I hope she wasn't watching much of this. She wasn't even in the room. She was out. Oh, maybe she had turned around. Every now and then I get a little... Um, yeah. So... I should probably not mess with these things and try messing with them in the flashback instead. I already said I'm not going to open up the fridge. I'm going to wait till the flashback. <laughs> Pile of cans. My cans. My precious antique cans. Whew. Open the door. I don't like that the first time you hit X, it just cracks the door open. Oh, and you do push that around. That's not like a... It's a doll. Oh, okay. I'm like, that's not like a teddy bear. It's like plastic. <laughs> creepy, creepy plastic. Um, so yeah, that back door key goes to here. That door. And like I said earlier, it always ends the run. At least... And so far it has. Do do. Oh yeah, I suppose. I mean, she didn't seem to. Yeah, she's a strong little girl. Hmm. All right, back to flashback world. So it starts at zero. I'm paying attention to the tape times this time. Tape times. No, the tracking lines were there before. Ah. Where did you find this guy? Give me a break, Pete. Hey, I only work with professionals. Speaking of which. Make sure the I sound a professional. is right this time. See? I don't want a repeat of Amarillo. That was two fucking years ago. I don't do ADR. All right. So I did not open the fridge in the current timeline. As future Clancy. So as past Clancy, I will open the fridge first. I might be reading too much into it, but... You never know until you do. No problem. These sort of things. Another worthless fucking shithole. Happy? Ecstatic. Oh, poor Andre. Are we rolling? Yep. All right, let's go. <clears throat> the bugs are back. Get out of the way. It's locked. Mm -hmm. After you. I don't know how you could relock so, this door. Why are we in hell this time? If he just forced it open crap? like that, What's you know what I mean? What's the crap? Shitty house, spooky sound. Ooh, is it haunted? Fuck me. I, I want to see when the know? door closes. Can sub, Pete. Not anchor. What's that? Nothing. Plus, but I've never actually seen it. You know what I mean? Like, it's probably yeah, it's probably gonna do it once I go around the corner or something. The usual. Oh, three years. It just closed. You didn't, you didn't see it. Oh, you weren't watching. But yeah, but it. Okay. <laughs> That voice is familiar. I want to see who voiced a lot of bad rumors Andre. About son, Lucas. Bad seat, apparently. Ah, shit. No, I should have worn my good shoes. 
All right. Man, Apparently, there's shot. something on the floor, according to my. Although, this would make a great backdrop. Mel Wyeth. Andre, what do you think? Andre? Microwave in the fridge. Between the microwave Andre. and the fridge, it's a very small space. Andre, Clancy, you see where Andre went? Microwave, fridge. Oh. <gasps> oh. What would I do if that happened to me? <laughs> Probably wouldn't last it? long. I would. I would. Fucking believable. I mentioned it this when is the I. Last time I worked with that guy. I mean, producers, they come and go. Yeah, I thought so. In that, in that drawer. You stick with me. Oh yeah. Another tape? No. Wet. Wet. <laughs> Um, yeah, if I were in this situation, I'd be breaking out a window. What the fuck was that? Did you hear that? Yeah, I did, Pete. That shadow of his hand just Andre? creeps me out every time. Where the fuck is he? Yeah, we're still going. This is uh, run through number five, and we're learning new things each time. I didn't realize it was uh, a repeatable, what do you call it, experience. So I'm not as freaked out by it as I was the first time, what but the there's hell? still been a couple of moments where I, where I almost pooped myself. You gotta be fucking kidding me. Me first, Pete, not you. All right, new deal. We find Andre and we go. We find I'm not even going to wait for you, Pete. I'm just going to go. I wonder if me picking the lock in the flashback messed things up. Ooh. Ah! Um, I think it's it's okay. I think it's a little too blatant of a ripoff of PT, and I don't think it feels anything like uh, Resident Evil. Whether that's good or bad, I haven't decided yet. It's fun. Obviously, I've been playing it for an hour and a half. Um, it's compelling. But I don't... It seems so bizarre that this has the Resident Evil name slapped on it. I don't know if it's a disservice or if it's a cool new reimagining of the series. Like, I'm not... You know what I mean? I haven't really settled on what to think. Oh. <gasps> axe. And my axe. Oh, my God. It's... Oh! It's a weapon. <laughs> My wife, my wife just got this look on her face like, mm, yeah, I know, honey. I got a fucking weapon. I wonder if I can fight back against Family Guy. It's totally what I'm going to call him. Can I chop you? Oh my, this is cool. All right, now this changes things, like 100%. I don't have the key yet, do I? No, I don't, because I didn't go back into the... No, I hear the dog breathing. Ooh. I hear a son breathing. Yeah, well, yeah, that too. But that's on the monitor. The dog breathing is behind me. <laughs> hey, I have a broken cat <laughs> What? Oh, I wonder if I can chop down these dolls. Creepy, creepy dolls. It's, it's, when I say a ripoff of PT, I, oh, I can break crates. I mean, it's because of the whole repeatable hallway 
um, multiple experiences uh, changes each time. And I'm very interested, uh, for sure. But at the same time, it's like, we wouldn't, this wouldn't exist without PT. And that, that kind of, oh, they turned without me looking. And I must have backed into this lady. Um, and it's kind of like, uh, it's hard to explain. Like, I, I want to see what Resident Evil 7 would have looked like in a world without PT, if that makes any sense. I want to see what the Resident Evil team, can I, no, I can't. What they would have made without PT being the crazy hit that it was. No, I, I get that. Right. Okay. Um, I'm not explaining myself well enough. The concept of here's the same thing, try it again immediately, and there will be a little difference. Like, like, that's... I don't know. I feel like I'm not elaborating properly. I know who you are. Okay, now this is the first the conversation. The oh no, it's not. Don't let appearances mislead you. See, now that conversation changes each time. That's not always the same. Yeah, it's like I said, it this wouldn't exist in a world without PT. And while this is cool and interesting and new Oh, give me let me chop the axe. Damn it. <laughs> So what do I use the axe for? We gotta get the hell out of here. The door at the end of the hallway? Come on. Oh yeah, I I get what you're saying. Oh yeah, he def the phone definitely seems to trigger him. It seems to be a timed thing after the phone. Um Yeah, um don't get me wrong, I'm not, like, discounting this at all, and I'm not saying that, like, I don't like this, because obviously I do. It's just part of me, I have a feeling like we're, we're entering a new kind of, like, era of Resident Evil, and part of me misses, it feels like I'm going to miss the whole, you know, Leon being cheesy American action hero in an anime about pseudo zombies you know what i mean like i that that crazy just action um and bad comedic one-liners and that sort of thing like yeah <laughs> exactly anyway i'm retreading old ground and i'm just yammering on and on about the same thing over and over again so What? I need to be more specific. I heard a noise. But it might have been in there. I'm not sure. Uh, I'll go look. Maybe in the kitchen. Now you're just making me walk through the house on my own. Nope. Nothing. I just did it just in case, so then I hear her before I swear, in case she gets up again. Yeah, 
Oh, yeah, Survival Saturdays. Yeah, no, I totally... Where am I? I totally agree. Oh, it's terribly dated. Um, but I still love it because I grew up with it. And that was like... That was my first horror... One of my first horror games was... Was uh, Resident Evil. The original and Resident Evil 2. Um, but, you know... The group that that we played Survival Saturdays with, uh, they didn't latch onto it. Even though they they really got into um, Silent Hill 2, which that was multiple years after Resident Evil, I guess. So, But yeah. Okay, see ya. Probably won't be, because it's pretty late here for me. And I gotta get up early for work and all that, but thanks for joining us so far. Um, okay, so I'll cut this. <laughs> yeah, he likes the challenge. But you know, that's like Silent Hill 2 on hard is one of the only ways that I play it now. Um, just because I've played it so many times. It's one of my favorite games. Alright, um, I put the fuse in. Yes, I did put the fuse in. And I got the videotape. Let's drop the stairs. Just cuz. No mannequin. That's weird. So, either... Answering the phone or leaving via the back door triggers Family Guy. However, I haven't tried axing. Oh, I can't bolt cutters the, <laughs> the VHS. I haven't tried axing the door at the end of the hallway, so that's what I'll try this time after I get the lock pick. VHJS. It's so weird. Boo. Where did you find this guy? Give me a break, Pete. Time hey, is it? Hey. I only work with professionals. Oh my gosh. Speaking of which, Go axe the TV, the yeah. Right this time. I don't want a repeat of Amarillo. All right, this will be my last run through. I don't do ADR. Uh just as a heads up. This new guy? <laughs> I'm not feeling it. Axe body spray the the TV. New plan. That way you can smell like first, Phoenix, or like Dark Temptation, to or I can't remember any other no fragrances. Tonight on the Sewer Gators, another worthless fucking shit. Happy? Static. But yeah, this will be my last attempt. And then depending on if I see anything compelling, or if I hear that there's more that I missed, I'll maybe do this again another night. Are we rolling? But my wife Let's is go. hitting the hay. And I do work all day tomorrow, so I better do so as well. Get out of the way. It's locked. Andre the big hero. After you. Big strong Andre. So I call him Strong Dre. Do you ever prep? What's the prep? Shitty house, spooky sounds. Ooh, is it haunted? I lost a viewer after that. <laughs> I can't. I can't say that I'm not surprised. Anchor, you know? We can sub, Pete. Not I mean, I. What's that? I can say. Wait. I. I don't know. What's the story, Andre? Abandoned farmhouse, missing family, foul play suspected. Um, if you like watching me play horror games, check out my abandoned? Alien Isolation LP. Years. Full LP, start to finish, 20 parts. Clancy, get a shot of this. Um, Let's make a great cutaway. Pretty good game. So, uh, Hillbilly Joe and his family go missing. Not Hillbillies, the Bakers. Jack and Marguerite Baker. And they were quiet. Yes, that's what I meant to say. I can't say that I'm surprised. Bad seat, apparently. I can say I'm not surprised. Ah, shit. I know I should have worn my good shoes. There's a pile of cans there. Oh, 
yeah. during r the regular Better timeline. Shots. During Although, future Clancy. This will make a great backdrop. Andre, what do you think? Andre? Andre! Andre! Clancy, you see where Andre went? Clancy? Damn it. <laughs> where is he? I can't oh, hear the name Clancy without thinking it. of... This is the um, last time I work with that guy. Police Chief Wiggum. I mean, producers, they come from, and go. From, uh... A good cameraman like you, Clancy? From... Hello. Uh, Simpsons. Me. Yeah, I did. So I'm gonna try axing this door. Andre! Or the television, I guess. The as was suggested. He? As was suggested. Hun, you can you, man? go to bed if you want. You don't have to wait for me to finish it. Or are you interested in watching slash not watching? Oh, I see. Okay. So my wife is literally stuck in the same room as me until I'm done playing. Wow. What the hell? Unless literally stuck. Unless our kids. <laughs> Suggested. You yeah, you. Yeah, I figured you'd like that. All right, new deal. We, we find Andre and we go. I mean, fuck this show. Slew jested. Not ingested. Not digested. Slugested. Let me suggest something. <laughs> oh, that's my brand of comedy. Is uh, keep going until my wife says, "All right, stop." <laughs> and here we go. Um, Ash. Yeah, my wife and I have to, and I said it before in this stream, but we have to... Huh? You said it when no one was on. I said it when no one was on. Yeah, well, that's because I'm also recording this to YouTube for posterity. But, uh... Wait a minute. Can I? Does it do it again? Shit, did I just... Am I just redoing? You broke it. Am I just... Is this... Is this the... Ooh. Yep. <laughs> yep, it's the Can same. find this guy? Give me a break, Pete. Hey, I only work with profession. I jumped. Stop video. Cool. <laughs> oh. Anyway, my wife and I have to continue our uh, cooperative playthrough of Resident Evil Revelations 2, which has been a really fun game so far. We just played the first episode uh, in its entirety, and we have the rest of the game to go through still. So now what was I... Oh, yeah. Axe... <gasps> oh my god, like, what? he just walked by the door. He did? Yes. No. Family guy just walked by the door. Shut your mustache. Okay. Now me talking about not being scared. Now I'm legit scared. L E G I T. Yeah, I also wonder if you can stop the video on the first playthrough. I'm so afraid he's going to just pop out at any moment. Did I not get the. You guys saw me pick up the box. 
the I picked it up. I know I picked it up. Oh my god, maybe it's because I put the tape back in and then quit. Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. Shit. <laughs> I don't want to have to go through that tape stuff again just because it's so long and I've done it all. Whatever, here goes. Too far. <laughs> and get my brain on something else. <laughs> Boo. Boo. Alright. I love you. Find this guy. Give me a break, Pete. Hey, I only work with professionals. Speaking of which, make sure the sound is right this okay. time. I don't want a repeat of Amarillo. That was two fucking years ago. I don't that know was... I can honestly say I didn't expect to see like see actually guy? see him in the environment. Again? Outside of just being the end game condition, so that that scared me. We do a walk through the inside first, then we shoot the intro, just like we always do. Just try to say the show's name this time, okay? No problem. Tonight on Sewer Gators, another worthless fucking Sewer Gators. Happy. Static. <sighs> These guys, all you guys. Are we rolling? Well, I do have an... In well, there's nothing right, there, go. but... It's funny, there's, like, the camcorder should be there or something. But as we've already established, I'm not even carrying a camcorder. My arms are down by my sides. I'm recording this with my eyes. So, why are we in hell this time? Do you ever prep? What's the prep? Shitty house, spooky sounds. Ooh, is it haunted? So life is, uh... Taking a break from watching. Fuck me. Creepiness is getting to an her. Anchor, you know? Weekend sub, Pete. No We're gonna anchor. watch What's the that? Nothing. creepy door again. The scary door. What's the story, Andre? Which is, of course, a reference to Futurama. Family, foul play suspected. The usual. And their ripoff. There it is. How long do you say this place has been abandoned? Three years. <coughs> Clancy! Get a shot of this. this make a great cutaway. Man, the fact that I gotta go through all this again. Uh, Hillbilly Joe and his family go missing. Not hillbillies, the bakers. Jack and Marguerite Baker. And they were quiet, not backward. A lot of bad rumors about their son, Lucas. Bad seat, apparently. That voice. Ah, shit. I gotta look up who that is. I, I should have worn my good shoes. Because I know I've heard it before. Alright, phone, don't fail me now. Glad I had my shots. Although, this would make a great backdrop. Andre, what do mm -hmm. you think? Andre? Resident Evil. Andre! Andre! Clancy, you see where Andre went? Clancy! Now that my wife's not here, I can do that all I want. Where is he? Unfucking believable! It's the last time I work with that guy. Oh no, never mind. I have to unlock this in the video. Because I don't have the lock pick on me in normal time. Clancy! <laughs> what the fuck was that? Did you hear that? Resident Evil 7. Biohazard, the video game. Oh, that's right. They're. Andre? That's so weird that they're combining titles. Where the fuck is he? Don't forget to use the pick. Yeah, I did. I I got it. Thanks. Andre, where are you, man? Um, that was the mistake that I made last time I was in the video. Was I didn't use the pick right away, and so then, uh, I didn't have it on me when I came back. And that was why I couldn't open it. And that's why I'm in the, the video again in this single run. What the um, hell? 
So Resident Evil 7 is called Resident Evil 7 Biohazard. And Biohazard is the Japanese title for this game. Right, I totally forgot that they're combining we Andre, and we go. those titles. We show. But I gotta look up who these voice actors are, because I know, I know one of them. Do, 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 do. Development. And down we go. Need a nice hero shot of me coming down the ladder. So, uh, you first. Yeah, he's not gonna come down the ladder though. Oh, hey, Andre. Doors closed. Ugh. The mere fact that I saw him walk by earlier just fucking. I'm like, I'm done. I'm done with that. Like, fuck that. Because that means he's an. That makes me feel like he's an entity moving through the house rather than just a triggerable cutscene. So now we're going to axe this door. Or should I try the TV first? No. Let's do the door. Choppy choppy. Does nothing. Damn it. I was really hoping that was it. Nothing. What have I seen? <gasps> no, I tried chopping the boarded up door upstairs. Well, the axe is in my inventory. Ugh, this game. I miss playing Overwatch now. Overwatch is only scary because I'd be losing competitive rank. Oh man, since they released uh, competitive mode on Overwatch, like I did my 10 placement matches and I went 7-3, and three, which was phenomenal. But, uh, then I played three actual, like, after my placement matches, I played three actual, fuck that phone, three actual competitive games, and lost all three, and I dropped two ranks. Um, I main, it totally depends on, depends on the match, but I play, my main offense is Genji, my main defense is, um, I don't play defense a lot, usually May, I guess. Uh, my main tank is, uh, totally depends on the match, Roadhog, Reinhardt, or Zarya, and then my main support is almost always mercy or symmetra i play i play a lot of different characters i really do i one thing i made sure that i that i tried was to get skilled with ooh whoa i didn't realize i could like destroy those 
are they watching us from that helicopter? No, it's a valid question. Because I know, I know some people who pick one character in Overwatch and they just play that one character. Yeah, Symmetra's great. So these guys do not get destroyed. But the one upstairs sure did. There, this axe has to be used for something, and I haven't figured it out yet. And I still have the dummy finger. Die! Oh, I can't get it. Okay. Should I answer the phone or should I do the back door? Open up the back door or answer the phone. Both of them are probably going to end the run, and this is my last run tonight. So which one should I do? I'm not sure. Any suggestions from the viewers? Try to go out the door or answer the ringing phone. Phone? Okay. <gasps> Wait a minute. No, do like a downward chop. Alright, I guess that's nothing. Slug, I'm guessing you've played this through plenty of times to its entirety, so I'm sure that you know what's going on and how to do everything. So I will take your advice and go for phone. I will take your suggestion. <laughs> hmm. I know who you are. Who, who are you? Memories hold the truth. Don't let appearances mislead you. Memories hold the truth. Welcome to the family, son. Yeah. Still. Yeah, I'm sure there's a lot to this game that I'm missing in just these five or six runs that I've done tonight. We gotta get the hell out of here. <laughs> That's the same as it has been each time. And the time is the same timestamp as before. So yeah. That's uh, the demo for Resident Evil 7. Um, what is... Uh, what Beginning hour. Yeah, I'll I'll figure it out eventually. I'll actually probably end up looking it up, so don't worry about it. Like I said, that's my last run through for tonight. I gotta get to bed. Um, it's one o'clock in the morning, and I work all day tomorrow. So thanks for watching. Um, if you're not subscribed, please subscribe. Uh, check out my other videos, my other LPs, my other one shots, my Overwatch streams that I do occasionally. Um, <laughs> yeah, suggestions pretty great. Uh, and as I said before, um, I am playing games for kids, uh, for children's hospitals, and you can donate for that, um, nicholascorey.com, and you can check out the Extra Life fundraiser on there, and donate 100% of your money goes towards kids who need it. Um, thanks for watching, and I will catch you guys next time.